Okay, yeah. So the, the EP was, uh, was work that was made around the same time as the album. So I made a huge amount of the work around then. Um, and it just, I had too much work that I could put on, any, on one album without overlapping on the themes and without it just being a, like way too long. So, um, so the four themes that on, on this EP are, are Limbo with Wildflower and Barley, um, Gluttony with Too Sweet, Violence with Empire Now, and the Ascent song, which uh, is Farewell. So they were sort of part of the family of songs on the album and they're getting to be released now. Yeah, too sweet. Yeah, it's kind of um, it's probably probably one of the more fr f sort of frivolous sounds. I mean, uh, songs I should say, in that it's like again, it's from the circle of gluttony, um, and it's somebody who it's a kind of a voice that is determined to, I suppose, self destruct, um, if that makes sense. So it's it's uh, yeah, kind of rejecting sobriety. It's a voice that is determined to self destruct in some way. Which circle of Dante's hell? Oh, oh my God, any one of them, literally any one of them. I'd say I'd be very, very welcome in Dante's hell. Uh, yeah, he was also, Dante was such a fundamentalist that like, I think if you farted, he'd put you in hell. So like, yeah, any one of them, yeah. yeah. What would be Dante's favorite song? Um, I don't know, maybe unknown, I, but I think he'd listen to any of them and he'd shout witchcraft, to be honest. So, uh, but maybe unknown. Um, I would love to. I maybe it's tough to know on a set, on a like a large festival set, uh, how a kind of a quiet song, especially a new quiet song, will go down. So, um, I think you can. I mean, these things are there for us to explore, you know. And, and in the same way, mythology is. It's all of these stories are there for us to explore and make sense of, in a, you know. And um, there's nothing stopping us from turning anything on its head and and seeing or either turning it on its head or just placing it next to the picture of our world around us and saying does this make sense does this still make sense does this still resonate with us and there all of these contradictions are going to happen and there you have your difference you know so yeah yeah i think um i wasn't aware of that and i mean i, I would be all for uh supporting the, a ban on com conversion therapy i think it's it's totally twisted um uh, it's a rather sick practice but um um i, I think for sure, I think songs like Take Me to Church have become, I never would have imagined that they would become uh, a work of such, of such comfort uh, for so many. So, so I'm very honored to be part of that song. Yeah. I don't know. I mean, I've been so blessed uh, in, in Latin America and with the shows that I've performed. So I'm just excited that anybody wants to come to the set and check it out in a place where I've never been before so far from, from where I usually perform, to be greeted in, in any way, to have people ready to listen to the music live is exciting and I'm, I'm thrilled, you know, it's, a, it's an honor to be here. Goodness, not enough, I think. Uh, if you have any suggestions of Colombian artists or particularly Colombian folk, I was given, I was just gifted a, a South American um, folk instrument for my birthday the other day. It's called a charango. Triangle. I'm yeah, not sure triangle. if I'm going to... Yeah, tri um, you know, this one isn't, you know, it's just like a little ten string, five strings and in two, two sets of five. Ten strings and two sets of five, and I've been enjoying playing that. Hey, this is Jose saying hi to everybody watching El Tiempo.